time to watch a brand new anime for fall 2024. This is called Let Thy Grieving Soils Rest in Something. Basically, it's like main character, weak, fraud, everyone around them, super OP. All of their merits and their credits kind of go to the fraud guy. And it's just like there's supposed to be this comedy where he just wants nothing of it, right? Let's begin today's reaction. Yeah. Treasure hunting. <laughs> this guy in the trailer as well. What the hell is he wearing? He just has like a cardboard helmet on? What is bro wearing, bro? <laughs> Look at him. Kurai is the main character? Who's the fraud? Finds important treasures. Phantom to Yobarelu Kaibuts to Tatakai. Master of Phantom. So it's like a dungeon system here. Probably like a guild, right? First step. Climbing the Shusai Clan is a bunch of parties that helps. Isn't it basically a guild? <laughs> like, like, monsters are called phantoms. Instead of instead of dungeon hunters or treasure hunters, <laughs> like they're they're basically just like taking established shit and they're just adding their own new fucking jargon to make it seem unique. This should basically solo leveling. Is she not her childhood friend? So I guess at some point, the main character got separated from their childhood friend. This is one of the girls, right? Hold up. 143. No, the girl, she has, I think she's more tan and she has like pinker hair. I think this is a different girl. She just had like a similar hairstyle, so I thought it might be. I don't think it is. Ruda Level 3? Level 3? Level 3? Chat doesn't even shake her hands. Sigma Riz, bro. Let these women know. Onna, you're not worth to shake my hand. Now she's charmed up, guys. Yep. This is how you get bitches, man. Mm -hmm. Just act rude and autistic around girls and they're surely gonna flock around you, right? それにしてもはあ、誰が素人よ。あしあなんて世間的には中堅でも。Mid I don't know if he's like on point because level three sounds pretty mid. And he says mid level, meaning it's probably like intermediate, but maybe the white wolf's den is actually really hard and the guy has a point, but he seems like he's being a misogynist right now. I like her. I like her a lot. She stands on business. She's not like cowering away. She's like, fuck you, man. What are you gonna know? Gonna fight now? Disqualified. <laughs> and cried the entire time, just wanted to just not be seen, just like actively backing out from the dispute. What is this guy all about? Like, if you want to just live a life in quiet peace, why are you joining a clan? I thought you just want to like retire or some shit. <laughs> He's still hiding his identity. <laughs> Maybe he's hide has hiding his identity on purpose because if people saw his face, they'd be like, oh my god, is it him? And the trailer seemed like he was pretty important in a fraudulent way. So maybe he's hiding his identity right now. Fifth time? Implying you failed every time and this is your fifth time trying to get into this clan. ねえ、くらい。あの派手なのはどこのパーティーあれは精霊の巫女、アークグレイブ。今回メンバーを募集してる中の国人でレベル7の宝物伝を。いや、あ、I mean, <笑> 
彼に認め Argent Thunder Clap Oh, them cheeks are being clapped like the thunder けど僕の知る限りでは彼らがこういう場でメンバーを取ったことは一度もあの一番奥の机はおいおいお前本当に何も Hmm Is Christ supposed to be there? Is like an empty spot? Also, didn't they say there's like supposed to be seven members or something? Six members, there's only five of them there? I don't know, but this position and cries. Mm, hmm. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Great Greg, you're only one level higher than her, bro. Are you talking all that shit when you're just one level higher? <laughs> Yeah. Reavers. Founders of this clan. Let this grieving heart. Grievers. What's going on here? Youngsters. Isn't it you guys? Yeah, it's them. They conveniently all wear masks, but this is the girl that I mistake the girl right now with, right? The same hairstyle, but different color, and she's like supposed to be tanned, right? So this is our party. Back in the day. This guy, right? This guy is the dude wearing the fucking cardboard cutout shit, right? It, it, this has to be him. Grieving souls. And if you look over here, Cry is right down here, right? So this party, the grieving souls, is the founders of this clan. Cry is here though, operating solo. Why? I don't know. Does he like escape from the party? Has he run away from the party? Because he doesn't want to be like center of attention. And now he's hiding himself. But why would he then show up here? Wouldn't he just run across towns? I don't know. Solo hunters. Beaters. Oh boy, here comes a hot shot talking all that shit. I bet he's gonna get corrected. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is this the girl that we saw in the trailers? Because there's that one girl that's what a part of our party, right? That shows so much thighs and booty cheeks. I think it might be her. Yep, it's her. It's her. It's her. She is a member of the Grieving Souls, right? I think it is. <laughs> She has a sister. Okay, so I missed. So in the trailer, I thought that she's part of the Grieving Souls, but she's not. Her sister is in Grieving Souls then? I I'm not sure, but she's not part of the Grieving Souls party, but I do remember from the trailer. That was the best part. <laughs> this guy is incredibly based. I've never. <laughs> he just straight up just confirms you're the fucking idiot, dumbass. No, you. Zombie force is a good fight. Everybody wants to see this. They're literally organized to pull out the fucking tables back. Yo, makes a scene. 1v1. Let's see this shit, bro. Everyone is so down. <laughs> Fuck him up. Oh shit, she doing that Goku thing, bro. She fucking jumping up and down, man. Oh, you're cooked. I want to see the fight. <laughs> I'm going to kill him, really? Oh, that was so sick. 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 Oh, that was she could suddenly detect cry and she's simping hard is my interpretation of this scene. <laughs> 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 
Wait. <laughs> Legs. That is so aggressive. And this is straight up from the trail. And I said, like, this line here is crazy that they decided to look at this, bro. Look at this thigh and the, the line that separates. Oh my god. <laughs> She, she, she went all from, I'll fucking kill you too. Ooh, ooh. I'm a little Discord kitten. <laughs> what the hell? He knows him? The Ikemen isn't even an asshole? He's a dude that recognizes Kai? Everybody. Yeah, that's why he's hiding his identity, but why? Why is he hiding his identity here? Founder. <laughs> so when he went to attack, she went the exact opposite way to cry. This poor bartender's table, man. He just fucked up it for nothing. <laughs> This is the opening playing, right? That's right. Yeah, that's him. Level 8. Thousand tricks. Thousand tricks to cry, Andre. This is interesting, huh? They had the opening play the entire time as soon as the secret was out, and then they lead into some of the visuals for the opening. I'm sure this is not the complete openings, but uh, pretty cool transition. <laughs> episode 1. I'm just so confused on how this opening is done right now. It's pretty cool. I'm just like, is the episode playing? Is the opening still happening? Okay, backstory. His friends are so OP. Yeah, sure, bro. No, I'm just useless. So everyone's gonna like misunderstand and gaslight Kurai into this like genius position. I wonder if secretly they do know that he's a fraud and they're just doing it to make him feel included and that's like the secret at the very end or something but yeah it's just misunderstanding misassumptions cry as a god yeah, everyone else is super op except cry i'm gonna assume that this girl is the bigger sister of that girl we saw in the intro theme with the thighs, simply because of the black hair. He's leaving? Is it just me or is this guy's armor just evolving over and over? No, no, he just didn't have the armor back on. But, like, before he had just a cardboard cutout. Now he has, like, actual armor. I'm just, like, seeing, like, how does he just keep evolving? I wonder if his armor is, like, every time we see him, like, a new thing is just, like, shown. Why? I did not expect that voice from this guy. I don't know, that umu is like very deep for this little boy, you know? They're masks, man. First step of the Kurama. He's just permanently sparkling. He just has a glow effect in this. Look at, look at these little twinkle stars, bro, which is emanating off of it. Still so 
<laughs> I don't know if the pretty boy is supposed to be toxic and mean though. I feel like he might just be a good guy in this anime. Usually these kind of types are fake, right? And they're all like, they're like super shitty. But what if he's just like genuinely good person? <laughs> Ah, more misunderstanding. So genius, man. Maybe his superpower, his innate talent, is for other people to perceive him in this way. Because, like, everyone just gaslights him, even though he hasn't shown anything. And they're willing to just do these mental gymnastics to justify all his actions. Maybe it's an innate talent that he just doesn't know about. <laughs> yeah, pretty much the chosen one. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Silence, woman. Ooh. But like, no one has ever been able to join his party, right? It's like a very rare thing, so people are freaking out. Just has utmost faith in him. Let him join. Let him join Ark's party. Literally plugging his nose. Ooh, うん。できめん。僕には人を見る目がない。Undefeated because he's never been actually challenged. That's some Makoto level of rings on his fingers right now. Holy shit, he has a lot of rings. Alright. She is not fucking around. Tino is so vicious, bro. <laughs> Landed the pose too. Look at that. Look at that landing, bro. 10 out of 10. <laughs> oh, poor bartender, man. His table got fucked up from his attack before. And now, the chairs are broken, his head got bashed in. Yo, somebody, please help this guy out. Where's the ring going? Which means? Bye. It looks like he just threw the ring because he knew it would cause a commotion. He could just make his exit. I feel like that was the entire point. In terms of his speech, though, he can't talk, huh? Like, like they, his friends did say, like, hey, you should be a leader. You're good at talking. You're good at giving speeches. Like, he did seem like a true clan leader there when he was, like, giving that little speech and saying, like, I've never been ever defeated. Ah, ja. All right, you got out. Damn, this is a clan house? The venue got blown up. Eva Runf. Oh, 
あいつ本当に心広いなよしじゃあ酒場の修理代のにも行ってもらってよ<笑>クライさんはアークさんに頼りそうにとお達しが<笑>ガーク支部長ほっとくとこっちまで来る護衛もいないのに変装用の宝具だって壊れちゃったでしょクリス装着そして起動あっという間にビジュアルチェンジおいっ<笑><笑> !Voice acting won't change.Your face will change, right?Oh y e a h 装着そして起動あっという間にビジュアルチェンジ Stop it, stop it, stop it. Why, why? These are the most cursed. This is so fucking cursed. Why does this dude have this fat of a rack, bro? Why is this girl has such a burly chest hair? Reverse face. Oh, it just changes to art. I ain't gonna lie. The comedy in this show has been hidden pretty well. It, like, it seems like that. That's funny as fuck to me. <laughs> 行ってくるこのためはないです悪気はないんです一般人に被害ないようにしてたし大体いい僕だって困っ Damn, bro Bald, but Dude, he's a big ass man Look at this dude And the girl beside her? Ooh, who is she? 完璧にやらせるしかないでしょうかおい勢いで教えるな Gark Welter Exploration Association Zebrudia Branch Manager Whoa, So like We may be a clan master, and a clan is basically a big party where it has a bunch of small parties all contributing. But what are they doing? They're going to explore and dungeons and treasure hunting. And this guy is like basically the group that has oversight on the whole exploration stuff, right? Basically, like hunters, if it's still a leveling, then this is like the Hunters Association, like other executive groups kind of like managing all this shit. <laughs> Did the pup guy mention? Hold up. Yeah. <laughs> Owner of that pub hall and I go way back. <laughs> okay, I'm glad that he actually got mentioned, bro. The bartender guy. <laughs> what? What was that at the very end? I want ice cream? <laughs> okay, randomly, sure. <laughs> Do they have good ice cream here? Hi, Kurai-kun. Yes, sir. Tadade Osamecha Shimu Yamero. Tansak Shakyo Kai. Tsusho Tankyo Niva. Hunter and Osamazamana is Kunai. Kikanga Mizikai. Nanido got Sotakai Nado no Ryu de Daremo Hikyu Kenai Mora. All right, we gotta do like community volunteer service. The hell? <laughs> Just switched up personalities. You were on your fucking knees, just groveling with your boots off, full dogiza, and suddenly you're acting like you're in the charge here. Echo, you know. Gaksa mo moto hunter nara wakaru de show? Yeah, yeah. Gaksa mo zutto sewa ni natte rushi, yari masu yo. Demo, hitotsu dake. Daita i konkai uchi. Skill ga agatte masen? Provoke skill. Erabe. Hai, hai. Does he just want the easiest shit ever? He's like, oh, come on, easier one. He's level three? Fuck yes, I'm in. Alright. I can't get so big and big. Rider's voice actor, right? Fate Zero. Blackbeard, One Piece. That's him, right? Sorry. If I think about like a voice actor who is just a giga chat, I think about this guy. Also in like a uh, mob psycho dimple, which was always a funny contrast of a little dimple in this giga chat voice. But like when I think about like giga chat Japanese voice actor in anime, I think about this guy. <laughs> しばらくもういないんだなマスターいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやい
you think you're going to be asked to date. I think that Krai is about to ask this girl to solve the three star level three rescue mission for him. I think that's what we're going to do. That's a good little tool. <laughs> she gone? Oh, I thought we could gaslight her into like joining us and helping us out, but she just fucking left. Huh? That's good. It's like a sentient chain that finds what you want. Okay. That's good. The CJ chain looked pretty decent too. What is this ending song? It sounds like a meme song, bro. Ice cream. The ending <laughs> her face, bro. The fucking stamp is literally bleeding into her face. No. We probably put her face there and stamped it onto the paper to make her agree. I don't know. No, I don't think it's really that. I think we're just trying to exploit your labor. Because Krai himself probably can't do it alone. So he's like, I need a tool. Oh, this is White Wolf's then. This is mentioned in the beginning of the episode. That other girl, right? Mentioned how it's like a really OP den. Oh, hey! Gilbert Bush is still one of the most ridiculous anime names I've fucking heard. Gilbert Bush. This is Ruda. We got fucking, uh, what's his name? Zangief, right? Yes, sir. <laughs> I think this is like previous step with the ending playing, right? No, this is pretty much just like the ending with like a little bit of recap of episode one. And yeah, and, and a little bit of preview for next episode. But that's pretty much it. Let these grieving souls retire. I like this show. I, I, I know it's not an isekai, but it has those, you know, isekai elements of basically just take out the, you know, other world or, and it's just fantasy land, guild, sorry, clans, right? An amalgamation of a bunch of parties. We have dungeons, which are basically, you know, you got instead of hunters, you have like treasure hunters and shit. It's pretty good. And I don't think it's even touched upon the potential that this show has because it has to do with like the misunderstanding of people thinking Krai is godlike and we haven't even seen the rest of the you know our party right our friend the childhood friend of course Ropi so I think that the first episode is definitely exciting and kind of sets the stage of all the fun bullshit that can happen and I'm excited for this and I hope that you guys will enjoy this show because I feel like this could definitely be like a humorous comedic you know dungeon hunter fantasy anime that we could enjoy this season that's it for me if you're still here and if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.